Hello, everybody. My name is Paul Anthony Williams, or you can call me Paul. Greetings, young portal master. Your adventure now takes an unexpected twist to the pirate seas. Help the swashbuckling Jess Legrand rescue her people from the loathsome Captain Dreadbeard and his vicious sea dog pirates. Adventure awaits. Set sail to Plunder Island. <laughs> Anyway, now we're going to go to the new level to uh, Pirate Seas. As we uh, sail off again. Ah, uh, nah. It's not going to end well last time, right? Oh, wait, no. Okay. Now I'm going to put something else on the portal. So this was the uh, first expansion pack I ever got. <laughs> Because, you know, Terrafin was my second Skylander. So Terrafin does come in this. And what I put on is a magic item called the Pirate Treasure. And it is very, very helpful, I must say. Okay, I guess it's called the Buccaneers range far and wide across the seas of Skylands, but the most villainous, scurviest pirate of them all is the sea dog Captain Dreadbeard. Even now, he is said to be looking for his next helpless village to plunder. Remember this his only weakness is his love of pirate card games. And I, you know, I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah, that's fine. Anyway, getting into it. There's our first treasure chest. Oh yeah, I guess... <coughs> Sorry. I guess the treasure chest is called the uh, dragon treasure. Not the pirate treasure, but eh, it's fine. There's some bowling pins. Ah, uh, man, I missed. Well, there's uh, Sun Smash's uh, ability, and we'll, and we'll uh, help him out later. I know I'm cruel. But over here, uh, we found a treasure chest and a life elemental gate. Sweet. Now, once... Alright, this uh, is probably one of the longer ones. Alright, uh, let me try the, uh... Okay, it actually works. Because in the HD version, I tried doing this specific glitch, and it just stopped some smash in his tracks. I don't know how, and I don't know why. Hooray for flying stump. Push this and, and it becomes like a little shortcut. Now if I throw this, it explodes and I got this little key right here. And and I gotta walk all the way around just to get this just to get that present. I mean, I'm grateful, but, eh. Now we have a pirate hat. <coughs> okay, I, w I was worried that I would have to walk all the way around again. Anyway, time to go save that guy I left behind. Uh...
Okay, so this is this is a memory game, if you will. And I guess it's the one thing I don't like, because I don't know. I just feel like it interrupts gameplay. Like, uh, what's stopping the Skylanders from beating these guys up? No, I mean, like, on a serious note, what's stopping the Skylanders from beating these guys up? Oh, look! Here's a pirate with a sword! Let's imagine, let's imagine that guy was, let's imagine that this guy had a sword, pulled out a sword and fought us. And look what happened! So, you know, question, why, why can't I just beat him up? Captain K9, eh? Bowling. Anyway, you'll notice at the bottom of the screen, the, uh, it will actually start glowing. And then when you actually find it, it, uh, shows up, and... Basically, once per level, uh, you can get you can uh, get treasure, you know. But there is a glitch in this game. Ah, here we are, Terrafin Soul Gem. We finally have all the Soul Gems for all nine of my characters. So I guess something about Terrapin Soul Gem that I I should say it is glitched. I will say this: the Terrapin Soul Gem is basically sort of glitch. What it does is it allows you to pick up power ups underneath uh, water, uh, while you're, while you're burrowing, basically. All right, and we get and we get the legendary treasure. Oh, and there's that glitch I talked about with the with the dragon chest. If you do certain actions, like talk to an NPC or, you know, any other type of stuff, uh, it will actually respawn. Anyway, I think that's enough of that. Sorry. Alright. Finally get to use Terrafin. Anyway, back to Terrafin's burrowing ability. Uh... If, if you try to burrow underground while getting food, for some reason, it w you'll collect the food, but uh, it's not going to... It's uh, not it's not going to be added to Terrafin's health. So it's like you collected it, but you, you get no health for it. Anyway. Now we got the, now we got the hat and the treasure. Oh, and I should point out, the dragon chest does not count for treasure completion. So even if you do find the dragon treasure, you still need to find, like, the three chests in the level. I don't know why I'm slowing down. <coughs> okay, okay, let me show you the glitch. I'm gonna get hit. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just gonna let these chompies hit me for a little bit. Okay. See that cake over there? See, I collected it, but my health didn't increase. <laughs> I mean, I'm just wondering why. Ah, they can handle. Wait, did Terrapin's children block the uh, cannon ball attack? I mean, that that would be that would be really good. No, like you know, like I just now realized that. Anyway, that takes care of him.
And we have more uh, cards to work with. Cards to work with. Okay, so some cards will actually increase your time. Okay, that could have been a wild card. Okay, so that could have been like a wild card. So, what a wild card does is, uh, if you, if you select it, any card, the next card you pick will, that wild card will actually work as that, what that card was, basically. Like, uh, say if I had a, pick the wild card, but then picked up the hat, that will actually count as me picking another hat. Oh, you gotta be okay. You gotta be careful with that. If you select the, if you select, okay. If if you select the uh, pirate curse, all the cards will be shuffled. All right. I'm just I'm just trying my best here. You know I haven't showed off much of the magic items yet. Hold on. Alright, so if I'm just gonna show off the uh, Ghost Pirate Swords, one of my favorites. Alright, now we're gonna switch to Zap. These are, these are kind of my favorite. So, so these things will just fly around and cut up anything that they come across. One will always prioritize the Skylander, and the other one will will always prioritize f far range. Okay. Okay, so, so, so getting two Peaky Boos will actually reveal some cards. Oh, and getting the uh, cursed card. Getting the pirate curse cards won't count. As get as selecting a card though. Ah, there's still some magic juice in this. All right, let's use it. Get him! Wow. All right, I think that's enough of the swords, you know, even though I would let it run out, but, you know, just want to give you guys an idea of what they do. Like, I just heard him. <laughs> Zappy zap, and the door's open. Okay, wait, there was a compass? There, there it is. Man, I'm just getting these today. Thank you. 
Okay, that's all of them. <coughs> Alright, now it's time to uh, use the uh, Pirate Seas ship. So if I do this... So all Avenger Pack levels if, are actually screen nukes. I know, n nice, right? But you can only use them once. Anyway, in the water, if you have Spyro or Gilgrunt, no, Terrafin cannot swim. Anyway, uh, the Pyrosaurs still have some juice in them, so... Might as well use them. Sorry. Ah, man, like, pair, pair this up with Chacha, and, you know, it would make the most sense. You know, Ghost, he's undead. Anyway, uh, here's the second to last guy. Ah, intimidating. All right. I hope I can. I I hope I can get through this quick, quick, quickly. Okay. Ah, darn it, I didn't pay attention. Okay, and I remember the cannons over here. There's the hats. Maybe it was up here? Okay, good. Alright, now for the final part. Ah, darn it. We gotta save her. Alright, tell the way. There it is! Thunder Island, dead ahead! We'll have to keep moving to avoid cannon fire from the main fortress. Move the ship left or right, and all the way forward for full speed ahead. I'll land the side gun. Alright, so I think this is a little bit more involved than the wall in the Empire of Ice, since one, you can move. Well, you can at least move around. <coughs> so the point of this is to destroy all the walls and maybe the pirate ships in this place. Uh, your shots are homing, so, you know. Eventually, they'll add more cannons. Alright.
And you know, you can shoot some pirates off. Honestly, I wish the ship would move faster. There's another cannon. Now, I believe I have everything in this level. Ow, stop it. Alright, let's go. Ah, darn it. Uh, I did not know what hit me right there. Alright, we got three more walls to take care of. Almost done. Just two more. I mean, it's kind of harder to uh, beat this level. I mean, I mean, fail at this. Oh, God. I'm about to die. Uh, t I, I would make a part of the Caribbean line, but I'm uh, not too good at this. You know, uh, okay, that guy's going somewhere. It's almost like he said, oh, he's up there. I'm like, oh, thank you. Fireworks going on. Can we get? Oh, I think. Hold on. Okay, that's what I was thinking of. Okay, got lucky there. Okay, that's probably like. That's probably like the largest. Okay, that 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 does that's what that 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 does what it says. Like it removes the curse. Chances of time uh, give gives you. Oh I, oh oh I need that. Chances of time gives you the most uh, of uh, time it can give you. All right, now the curses are removed. I got, I'll just use the wild card. Anyway, this level isn't, you know, that interesting. I'm not that interested in this level, though. I don't know, probably because of the cards. All right. Later. You know how she, fr you know how how that, you know, with how she phrased the so am I thing, it makes me think that she has the crush, a crush on the character that you're playing as. So maybe she has a thing for, um, uh, sea serpents that shoot electricity. Anyway, now it's Wrecking Ball's turn. Hopefully this level won't glitch. All right, time for the speedrun challenge. I'll take this. Yummy. Luckily, I can just roll it to these guys and just do the chat. Didn't just do this. Anyway, that's six here of that. Ah, 
that. Not too worried about this guy. Did he just dodge out of the way? Luckily, this level is very is one of the quicker ones. Uh, Rocky Ball sort of disappeared there for a second. <coughs> oh, hey, Anchor Guy, how you doing? You know, I just find it comedic that uh, I can just ignore everything. Alright, there's the hat. And I'm guessing this is the wild card. All right, time to get going. Oh, how polite of them not to attack me while I'm, while I'm doing this. Oh, you're doing a pirate card game? Oh, uh, yar. As for pirate code, we cannot uh, interrupt the game. You know, it's, that that's 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 uh, sort of nice of them. How does he have two beards? If he's already fuzzy. Anyway, let's go. Uh, I don't think you can swim towards the uh, next part of the map. They they sort of thought ahead. <laughs> there it is. Alright, what can we see? Alright, add some time. And that's it. I'll eat you. There we go. Ah, come on. Ah, darn it. I thought I could eat him for a second. Alright, there's the map. I would sing the Matt song from from uh, Dora the Explorer because, you know, I you know I'm just like a early two thousands kid. But I don't want to get you know. I don't want this video getting taken down. Huh, that was weird. Anyway, time to get going. We're at the final stretch. I'm not even gonna bother with these guys. Hey, he just popped my he just popped my ball. Eh, why not? I'll eat some of I'll eat some of these guys. Anyway, second to last pirate, or in this case, last pirate, but he but he comes back for a round two. No beer, no beer. Ah, All right. Ah, ah, All right. I thought I saw a, a, a schooner up here. Alright, I have a 
Okay, and there was Big Boo right here. I didn't feel like getting it. Well, I guess I, I guess I can show off what happens. It wastes time and it scatters the cards. Ah, uh, it's all right. Anyway, now now it's time to set sail and blow up the pirate island one one more time, or the pirate base. That's one. Anyway. Yeah, I do kind of wish the ship would move faster. Alright, come on. Like, I want to say this would be a boss fight, more like a mini game. Hey, you know what? It's fine. It doesn't have to end on a boss fight. <laughs> I mean, what am I going to do? Fight a bigger pirate? I, you know, I, I feel like, you know, they, they uh, made these adventure packs to, uh, well, not only really, uh, expand and I guess get money, but in this case, any, every company's trying to get money. You know, I acknowledge that they aren't making this because they want to, they're making this because uh, they, they want people, they want money from us. Uh, I, I almost dodged that one. I need to turn around. Because I need to get this, get, need to get this. Anyway, time for the last cannon. <coughs> I don't know, I, I think they, they just wanted to like, uh, expand like the little gimmicks, if you will. He's just gonna waddle up all the way up there. Like, I feel like that they made a venture pack to, you know, show off some gimmicks or whatever. Alright, last card game. Hopefully, I got this. Well, I guess I do got this. And there it goes those power cannons going off. I think after this, uh, after, uh, as soon as I'm done uploading this, I might play Swap Force again because, because, uh, to me, at the very least, uh, you know, it is their anniversary, and I do want to play it again. Okay, there's the map. Thank you, boo. Alright, there's the she beard. It's a cannon event. You don't break the cannon. And that's the care of that. Uh, Alright, did I do well? Yes, I did. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. My name is Paul Anthony Williams, or you can call me Paul, and I will see you all again next time. Have a good day everybody.